Every one of us have ways of running our enterprise on the internet. Some run their content creation as a hobby, while some run theirs as a business. Now, if you run your content creation on any Google platform as a hobby, like you upload videos on YouTube to share your life with the world, or you do the same with a blogging website, having a single AdSense account will be fine. But for some of you that take content creation, especially on Google platforms like YouTube as a business, having more than one AdSense account will be okay. Someone asks, if I have four different channels, must I have four different AdSense accounts for each of them to monetize? The answer is no, you mustn't have four different AdSense accounts for four channels. But if you wish to have it that way, you can. When you are applying for YouTube Partner Program, you are asked if you have an existing AdSense account or if you want to create a new one. If you already have an AdSense account and you want to link it to the channel you want to monetize, you select yes, I have an existing account. But if you want to create a new AdSense account for the new channel, you will select you don't have an existing account. Then you can create a new AdSense account for the channel you want to monetize. But you must use an email different from the email of your existing AdSense account. As a business, like in my country Nigeria, you are expected to have more than one bank account or more than one telephone line or contact so that when anything goes wrong with one, you can use another as a backup or you can dedicate one for general customers and the other for special customers. So let me bring this closer to content creation on YouTube. Let's say you have a profitable YouTube channel and you want to create a new channel to test a new kind of content like reaction videos on it and you are not sure if YouTube will patronize that on their platform. Suppose you linked your healthy AdSense account to this new channel that you are experimenting on and all of a sudden Google bans that channel for violating their policy. It might affect the associated AdSense accounts and in other words, if that happens, it will also affect other channels that is linked to that AdSense account. You get the point. I do recommend having more than one AdSense account when running multiple YouTube channels or websites because anything can flag any of this channel and if there's a problem with a particular channel that is linked to the AdSense account, other channels or website that is linked to this same account will be affected. If you have more than one YouTube channel, you can create more than one AdSense account for them, but it is not compulsory. Like you can use one AdSense account to run more than one YouTube channel and you can also use more than one AdSense account to run one YouTube channel. But the only difference is that you can only use one AdSense account to one YouTube channel at a time, but you can link one AdSense account to many YouTube channels at a time. The good thing about having one AdSense account is that you can monitor all your earnings in one place without jumping from one AdSense account to the other to check your earnings. But if you're trying to experiment with a dicey type of content on a channel, create a dedicated AdSense account for that channel so that if anything goes wrong with that channel, it won't affect others. If you need an assistance with a paid consultation with your AdSense application or issues, follow me and give me a DM on Instagram. And if this video was helpful, let me know by giving it a thumbs up. If you want to know how to create an AdSense account and link it to your YouTube channel, watch this video. And if you want to know the updates on the new AdSense facial verification, watch this one. First has ways of running their enterprises on the internet. Some run their content creation as a hobby. Hobby. See hobby or hobby.